Hello Virgo, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your money and career tarot reading. It will be for October 2021 for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon rising in Venus. So I hope you well Virgo. Let's get straight into your reading and pull your overarching energy. So Virgo, remember these readings won't resonate with everybody. Just take what resonates with you. Okay, what do we have for our lovely Virgos? We have Page of Wands. Let's get another card with that one. What do we have for Virgo? Oh my goodness, we've got the sun with that. That is beautiful. I'm getting you've been waiting for something to happen here. Let's see what we have. What do we have for Virgo, please? Passion. I just feel something is lighting you up here. Okay, Virgo, let's uh, see what we have. I'm getting a strong, strong indication someone's been waiting for not even waiting but maybe something was put on hold here what do we have for virgo please message for virgo ace of cups new beginning energy queen of wands king of pentacles Four of Swords, Ten of Swords, bottom of the deck, we have the Six of Pentacles. Let's clarify the Ten of Swords. Yeah, I knew it. Hanged man. I, I knew you were waiting. You've been waiting. And the hanged man isn't a few days. It's generally a few weeks, months. You know, it's, it's a period. Okay. Well, Virgo... You are just going to be lit up. I mean, this passion energy. I feel you really wanted some opportunity here. And I definitely get this energy of something was put on hold. Uh, or it, it was going to happen and then it wasn't going to happen. Maybe. Yeah, I'm just getting this energy. For whatever reason, it was either on hold or everything was all systems go and then it wasn't going to happen. And, you know, there was a lot of disappointment, a lot of disappointment because it's something that you really wanted. Cups energy. I really, really, really want this. Well, it's back on. It's back on. You're going to get some news. Can be to do with an opportunity here and it's good news. It's happy news. Just feels really beautiful. That sun energy is just bringing real happiness in. And it's to do with the news that you're getting. It can be to do with an opportunity. Everything's back on. Um, so if you have been, if, like I said, if it's been on hold or was going to happen and it, it fizzled out for whatever reason, could be COVID, um, something is being back on so definitely put feelers out again uh i mean it could be with recruitment agents or you know with an organization that you know you thought something was going to progress with an opportunity an opening i feel it's back on ace of cups you know this is a new beginning and i feel it, it the challenge was it it didn't happen i mean you know 
But I feel in this situation, the new beginning is coming again. Yeah. I just feel that it was something that was budding, that was opening up for you. And I don't feel for whatever reason it didn't happen. And there was a period of waiting. But this is given to you by God, the divine, the universe. It is an ace, which is a magical blessing energy in tarot. So it certainly feels that this new beginning is back on for you. We have the Queen of Wands. You might be dealing with the Queen of Wands. Uh, very good as a business leader, somebody in business. Um, somebody who is really charismatic male or female energy a charismatic leader a go-getting energy somebody who isn't taught but acts has the action to back it up uh, somebody who understands how to make something happen very confident energy very self-assured understands exactly what they're capable of and has a great deal of self-belief i mean you might be dealing with some they might hold this wand energy i'm seeing the page holding the wand I'm seeing this queen holding the wand as well. They may hold the opportunity here. Now, as another, if it's the energy of this card, it's the card of taking action. So taking decisive action. Uh, something is coming in. There is some news and you need to act. And you need to act quickly. I feel this is you, Virgo. You know, the king of pentacles. Uh, this is an energy of knowing that you have all the resources, the practical know-how, the capability to bring success your way. And I feel Spirit is reminding you of that. You have every, everything that you need to make this happen. It just feels a really beautiful energy, the King of Pentacles. You understand how to bring stability and security and safety back in your life. And I feel in this energy, there is something that's opening up for you that's back on. That will allow you to bring that new level of security and safety, stability into your life. Because I feel that you've been challenged on that here. Certainly the Ten of Swords energy, I feel you've been challenged. There could have been some loss. Um... Or some painful circumstances that you've been dealing with. Difficult circumstances that you've been dealing with. And this, this will put you back in your element. And that's what the universe is saying here. It's almost like this has got your name on it, you know? Four of Swords energy. This is an energy of... I feel you've been waiting... You know, waiting for the recovery, waiting to see the way forward here. It just feels this kind of energy here of looking at your situation and trying to see the way forward. And I feel in this energy, spirit is bringing in the direction for you. Spirit is bringing in the gift for you. We have the hanged man waiting, being in a period of limbo for whatever reason here. I mean, for some of you, health may have played a part in terms of your money career as well. And it might well be for some of you, you are recovering in a situation now. You are getting back on track. You are now. And you may well have been looking for an opportunity and maybe it fizzled out for whatever reason here, Virgo. Uh, you may have felt in limbo for a period of time as a result of that. But I feel it's back on. Some opportunity is back on here. Uh, and I feel that there's news coming in that's telling you that. That will allow you to put whatever this painful situation behind you. Again, some of you, it could have been health issues. For others of you, it could... I mean, this can be a card of being betrayed, stabbed in the back, thrown under the bus, scapegoated... Um, loss, I mean call it what you will it's an array of things with the Ten of Swords but is it, it is an ending it is an ending that you have found difficult to move on from but the message is you are releasing from that hanged man energy now that period is soon to be over and why? because there's an energy of someone's reaching out offering you something uh, it might not be everything that you want 
but it's certainly what spirit is saying this is what you need so this is absolutely an energy of someone is reaching out to you offering you something like I said it might not be exactly the money you want it might not be exactly the title you want it might not be exactly the responsibility that you want it might not be exactly in the area that you wanted it to be in however you know that hangman energy is about being open to new possibilities you know that change of perspective is just as important you know to bring in this new energy so I certainly feel Virgo there's a gift coming in from the universe here um, I mean this is a lovely energy uh, and it's just lighting you up and you're being told don't think twice take action love the reading I feel something was on hold or fizzled out and it's back on final message for Virgo thank you hedgehog acceptance embrace who you are yeah I think he's just putting you back in your element you know Virgo king of pentacles Taurus Virgo Capricorn male or female Eagle ancestral healing. Your ancestors are holding space for you to heal your past. It's a lovely energy. I hope you enjoyed the reading. It's very beautiful. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you.